Hello and very good to all boys and girls. How are you? Welcome to another new video for the channel, and today I bring you a new tutorial on how to lower the lag in Roblox and optimize it 100% so that it goes crazy, and we don't have any lag before we start. I would appreciate it if you could leave a piece of like, people, subscribe to the channel to continue uploading many more videos of this type. And with that said, people, let's start with the video. The first thing you have to do, people, is to click on the escape key, and we have to go to the configuration once we are here. Here we go down a little, and here in the graphics mode section, we have to change the automatic, and set it to manual. The most likely thing is that everyone will come out in automatic, and you have this entire bar reloaded to lower the graphics. The only thing you have to do is lower this bar towards the minimum, and the only thing that takes away is a little bit of luminosity, but the game is going to be much better for you with this change. The second tip people press Windows plus R, and it will open this screen to execute here. What we have to write is percentage percentage, and click on accept, and what we have to do here is copy all these files that you are seeing and right click, and what amounts to deleting them, this will make the temporary files on our computer are deleted, and things go much better for us. The next step is to open this computer, and on the local Windows disk, right click on properties. Here we have to go to the free up space section and here, as you are seeing, the program files will open. Downloaded temporary files, we select everything you want do you want to delete? For example, the trash can that I have is 5 gigabytes, etc, etc. Select all of them and click to clean system files. The following is the Windows key. Look for the control panel and open it. Go to the hardware and sound section. Go to the power options section. And once we are here, we go to the top left to choose the behavior of the start and shut down buttons. And here in shutdown configuration you have to have recommended here, I recommend it you have to have this option activated. Activate quick start allows your computer manner faster than turning it off does not affect the restart. To activate this option you click above to change the currently unavailable configuration. And it disables it, I have it disabled that's why it tells me to enable it and so. On with all of them. For example are sent same, and so on all the applications, that if you are looking here we have to press the windows key advanced configuration we put advanced configuration here and we see the advanced configuration of the system we have to go to the performance section and click on the configuration section once we are here click on the section adjust for best performance and this way the computer will be much better for you so wait people i hope you liked the video don't forget to leave a piece of like subscribe and see you next time greetings and goodbye